Next up on the track, it's another final, the men's 400 metres. The world leader, Christopher Taylor, goes for gold for Jamaica. Miles Misnadeli of Canada will go on the inside in lane one. Here's Howard Trayfields, as he's known. Scotty produced a brilliant kick, the Italian, to secure his place in the final. Sawyers of Jamaica, second year in Jamaican colours for the Florida Gator. What a cool customer this young man was, Jonathan Secure. He's first in the world's top ten here this week. But this is the man they've got to beat, the Jamaican captain, Christopher Taylor. Only athlete to break 45 seconds this year. Kamal Stewart-Baines, second behind Taylor in the semi-final. And Jonathan Jones of Barbados. Goes on the outside in lane eight. Busy time for him in this championship. Here's the lineup then for the final of the men's 400 meters. Christopher Taylor with Jamaican hopes for gold. Jonathan Jones carries them for Barbados. Canadian Stuart Baines is there. Taylor aiming to become only the second Jamaican 400 meter champion in under 20 history in the men's event. Don't rule out Chance Sawyers being in the mix as well. Scotty came from nowhere. It was a national record for him in the semi final. Fields represents American interest. Still waiting for a gold. Miss Nadaly on the inside. So Ms. Nadaly, Fields, Scotty, Sawyers, Sakur, Taylor, Stuart Baines and Jones Barbados. The eight finalists, but maybe only one man to beat. Four hundred metres final here in Tampa Eight for the men. Set. We'll keep an eye on how quickly Taylor gets away in lane six, and it looks like it's a good start from him. He's moved away a little bit from Jonathan Sakur, who ran so well in the semi-finals. Chance Sawyer's going well to hit the back straight in this final. Christopher Taylor has gone out hard. He is a really fast 100-meter runner as well. He's showing that speed down the back straight. It's Taylor with destiny in his hands, and he's miles clear of the rest of the field at the moment. Sakur is... One of those trying to catch him. The other Jamaican is Chance Sawyers, but they'll come into the home straight. And this race is looking like it could be all about one man. Look at the times on the left of the screen as well. But is Taylor tiring? Because here comes the Belgian Secor. Are we going to have a big upset? Taylor's gone, and Secor is the world champion in 45.03. A huge upset of these world championships. Taylor. Dominant for 330 metres, but he lost it in the home straight in a huge shock. And this Belgian, Jonathan Secor, has just shattered the national record of his country to take one of the most unbelievable goals we'll see this week. Jonathan Secor of Belgium is the world under 20 champion. Christopher Taylor is beaten in Tampa A. Jonathan Secor timed that run to perfection. Was able to see Taylor throughout the race, stayed relaxed, stayed calm, and knew he had enough strength in those legs in the last 50 meters. What a performance by him. He has blown away his own personal best national record. You see Taylor here. He had an incredible lead on Secor at this point. But Secor was calm, relaxed, knew what he had. And you see Taylor beginning to tie up a little coming off the bend, paying for that early fast pace. And Secor just came like a train down the home straight. Stride by stride, he was just ripping that track up. Incredible performance by this Belgium athlete.
It is a Jamaican 2-3. Taylor, no doubt, does tire a little, but you have to say that's as much as about the acceleration that Sakur found in the last 100 metres, and he did it in the semi-final as well, Absolutely. just finding a, a fabulous finish. Absolutely. We saw the exact same tactic from him in the semi-final. Stayed relaxed, stayed calm around the second bend, and all of a sudden, with 80 to go, he just has a reserve. And what a talented young man he is, part of the Belgian senior 4x4 team. And this is an, incre it's an incredible upset. Taylor was the only man under 45 this season, but Sakur was just too good tonight. That was the second fastest time in the world this year. Taylor still has a silver to take back to Jamaica, and congratulations to Chance Sawyers as well with a bronze, as the Jamaicans did the 2-3. Absolutely incredible. What a run from Sakur. To be that far back with 100 metres to go, stay relaxed in his technique and his style and power down the straight. Extremely impressive. Look at here. I mean, incredible. Absolutely metres back. And just looks so relaxed. Exactly what he did in the semi-final. Just breezes through the field with 60 metres to go. Wow. Well, that's a super run, isn't it? Yes, it's talk about moving through the gears smoothly. Sakur has really shown us how to do it there. What a stunning run from Sakur. You are the world under 20 champion. Amazing feat. Jonathan Sakur, a national record. And in these championships, he's broken an under 20 record that had stood for 45 years twice.